We're going to use Excel's solver function to solve an equation. So first, let's uh, let's just make a range of values from zero to pi. We'll start at zero, and here we'll say equals cell above it plus pi. Don't forget these parentheses. Divide by twenty, and let's go ahead and take this and drag it out. We should get values from zero to pi. Um, here we're just going to take the cosine of this, let's say equals cosine of this value. And when we drag this out it should go from 1 all the way to minus 1. Now we're going to take all these x values, let's grab this column, copy it, grab this column, and paste it. And so we just bring it over there. And now let's uh, select all of these columns. So let's shift click through there. And let's insert a scatter plot. Just like that. Now we can see um, here's cosine of x right here. And here's just x equals y. And so we can find out when cosine of x equals x where these two intersect. And it looks like it's about 0.75. Um, but we can use the solver function to find the exact value. Uh, first of all, let's uh, go up into this cell and let's just say x equals, down here we'll type cosine x equals, and here we're going to put our guess for what it equals. We think it's about 0.75. Let's go ahead and type that in. And the cosine of x, um, we are going to, we're going to make a formula here. We're going to say equals cosine of this value minus this value. And the reason why we're going to do this is this is equivalent of saying we want to equate x and cosine of x together, see where they're the same. So if we take cosine of x minus x and set it equal to zero, we can find out where that value is. And so we're just going to zero this out. Now first of all, you might not have the solver installed. You will if in your data tab, in the, you have an analysis tab and the solver button here. If you don't, go ahead and go to this, go to Excel options, um, add-ins, and you can click go here and you can add the solver add-in right here. Uh, mine's already added so I'll just continue. Um, so let's go ahead and use the solver now. So click solver in the in the data tab and we are going to make a target cell. Now the target cell is is um, what we're going to try and set this to. So we want this equal to zero like our, our equation was. So we're going to keep that at H2. You can just select that if that's not already selected. And we want to make it equal to a value of 0. And the, what we're going to do is we're going to change cell H1. So you can go ahead and select this cell here. So it's going to change this value back and forth until this value equals 0. Go ahead and hit Solve and let's keep the solver solution hit OK and you can say it got as close to zero as it could and it's at 0.739 so pretty close to our guess of 0.75 so we can use this to to solve equations